back at it again with another video. So thank you for watching. I appreciate it. So this video is about President Taylor Swift. And this is one of those videos that is kind of like a fantasy, but you know, one of the things that could absolutely be reality if she actually puts her mind to it, which is crazy because she's like ultra powerful, like legions and millions of fans love her. So what would happen if she ran for president? Just fantasy, hypothetical, what would, what would happen? Like how, like it would probably be a landslide and ultimately Taylor is currently 33 and to be president requirements, you have to be at least 35. So won't be able to run in 24, but it would be able to run in 28. So she endorsed Biden in 2020 with cookies. Um, so what would happen if Taylor decides to run for president, which is kind of crazy, but would be kind of funny, actually. All right. So she, since she endorsed Biden, she'd probably run as a Democrat. So how would the map look? This is going to be wild. This is going to be wild. Okay. Probably would win California landslide. I mean, California is already a blue state. Oregon, Washington, these states out here have been solidly blue for a long time. Hawaii, yeah. New Mexico, probably. Colorado, probably. Pretty consistently blue states right here. Minnesota, Illinois, pretty consistent blue states. Maryland, Delaware, Jersey, Virginia, pretty solid. D.C. also. New York also. Um, yeah, so these are the pretty solid blue states. We got some pretty solid red states in the plains, out in the Rocky Mountain area, also here in the south, also. So here are states that are solidly blue or uh, Iowa's technically a battleground. I don't believe it to be, but. All right, so here are the solid blue states, solid red states. Now, if Taylor ran for president, she probably would sweep a bunch of states. She's definitely not winning Tennessee, home state. It's just way too red. But she would win Pennsylvania, probably. If you are from, was it born in Pennsylvania? Or in Pennsylvania for a long time. You'd probably win it. Honestly, I I think if Taylor ran in twenty twenty eight, she would honestly flip Texas, which is like which would be a massive political earthquake. But I think I think suburbia, you know, Texas Triangle goes goes crazy for her. Arizona also, and she's performed so many shows in Glendale, Arizona loves her. Probably go blue. Um Iowa, Nevada. To be honest, I think she'd take Nevada. I don't think she'd win Iowa. Probably not Ohio or Florida. But probably Georgia. North Carolina, probably. Michigan, probably. Wisconsin, I have no idea. New Hampshire, maybe. You know what? There we go. 359. Maybe that. I don't know. If Taylor would win, would she win Ohio and Florida? I don't know. That would get up to 406, but I think Florida is taking a hard right turn. Uh, Ohio, probably not. So this would probably be the Taylor map, honestly, in 2028. Maybe Ohio. Maybe. Maybe up to 376. Maybe. Iowa, I don't know. I was taking a right turn also. I mean, it's not, a, you know, a huge landslide. You know, you need 270, you get 359. This would, this would actually be an interesting map. I, I honestly think she would get Texas. I really do, because suburbia loves Taylor Swift. And if you're going to flip Texas, you got to flip the suburbs. And... I think Atlanta likes her a lot. I think Arizona likes her a lot. 
I don't know, Pennsylvania probably. I don't know. I, I think if Taylor runs in 2028, which is, again, unlikely, but humor me for my delusional fantasies for just a little, little bit. I think this would actually be a somewhat realistic map. I really do. Um, maybe Ohio, maybe Florida. I don't know. Anyways, I just want to see it happen. I mean, Taylor Swift would be an iconic president. She really would be. Um, yeah, I just want to see it. I really do. Um, again, requirements need to be 35, so won't be able to do it until 2028. But Taylor Swift for president. Let's let's make it happen. I rock with it. I rock with it. I really do. Um, yeah, that being said, that's the end of the video. Thank you for watching. Thank you for going down this potential fantasy, you know, with me. Appreciate it. And I, uh, I'll see you in the next video. Deuces.